Real, real, real talk, man. You know, shouts out to the local crew car club, man. You know what I'm saying? For pulling up on the homie. The local crew crew yeah. car club. They yeah. pulled up on me. Shouts out to them. You know what I'm saying? Oh, they they, they had you lit in there, man. Yeah, you yeah. had the old schools out. Yeah. I know yeah. you got one or two. You ain't got 16, though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't got... <laughs> them ain't all mine. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> them ain't all mine. I ain't gonna lie to you. People be trying to act like it's hella raw to have hella cars. But, man, I don't know if y'all know... <laughs> I don't know if y'all know. They seen gas prices. Nah, huh? it ain't that. It's it's the it's upkeep. yeah the upkeep. They don't know about them them. If you don't got insurance on every single car, the tags and all that, then you got to yeah. get the non-operating parking permits and stuff for the other cars that that's serious. parked in the garage. Like the other cars that I'm not even driving now. They they like you got to put a non-operating permit or you got to keep paying the insurance, keep updating the registration. They sh- and if they, I want to pull it out every now and then, and then they'll tow your school, car. Like yeah, or they'll, they'll tow it. it. You know, if it's not, you like, bro, this car, yeah. like, it's not bothering it's, nobody. Like, bro, this in front of my crib. What are you saying? Right. Like, nah, bro. <laughs> and then street sweeping, right, right? The street sweeping. Now I got to go outside and move two cars to the other side of the street. You ain't lying. Like, bro, that shit got tiring. And you know how it is in Frisco. You know what I'm saying? You know, I have yeah. the crib over there. You know, and then, bro, I had a 69 yeah. Skylark, bro. That got, they told me. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. And I was so young that I was scared it to cop. I, I was scared to even tell my parents about it. Right. But I should have told them because we would have kept the old school. But anyway. Right. They would have just went and pulled it out. I got they would have got, got it out for me. But I was you. so scared and like dumb. That you was, had goofed up like that. You was like, I goofed up. I'm not going to say I nothing. I don't want to say nothing. Exactly. Stupid. Hey, anyway. You know what? We got to stop up? doing that. <laughs> Talk about it. No, we got to stop doing that type nah, of stuff. for real. No, bro. Listen, listen. This is the other thing. Like, literally, bro. If somebody do you wrong and they violate your rights and do, bro, sue them, bro. <laughs> Straight up. Bro, stop being scared to go do the legal thing that right. you're supposed to do. Um, Moms, mothers, black mothers, I want to talk to y'all real quick. I love y'all. I just want to briefly say something to y'all real quick. When they got your son down there at the precinct, don't be scared to go down there and get your baby up out of there. Let them know. Because I'm going to be honest with you. The other folks going to go down to the precinct and say, where's my son? Right. Where's my boy? Bring him out here right now. Right. They busting in. Up. Where's my you child? No Y'all manhandling my boy in here? Bring him out here. Talk to him. That's what they going to say. Huh. But our, our people at the house scared. Oh, they got Jamal down there at the precinct. What'd he do? I don't know. Uh, shit, he might have did it. Right. Don't just assume your kids is guilty. Get them up out of there. Don't let them like, talk don't to just the a, Yeah, people. come yeah. on, man. Stop leaving it up to them to figure out what happened with your kid, man. Straight up. Go down there and protect your kid. Go get your kid. That's all I'm saying. Like, protect your children. Go down there. If they got my boy, I'm not scared, bro. I ain't broke no laws. I know I'm a nigga, all that. I don't care. I'm going to get my son. I want to see my son. Bring him out here right now. Facts. Hey, dude, don't say nothing. Shut up. Your right. lawyer coming. Right. You feel me? Real Go talk. get your kids, man. Yeah. That's all I want to say. Like, I feel like we need to take more more initiative. power and initiative yeah. and we always talking about the laws and how the shit don't work for us but we ain't using them we not using them correctly we not using them correctly right so use the laws that we're ignorant in place. to what we need to do to right. implement what we, we what needs to get done exactly we scared bro we bro we scared people be so scared you feel me? We so scared to go fill out the paperwork mm-hmm. scared to go down there like I'm going to keep it real Niggas think if they go to the precinct, they going to get kept down there. Right. Yeah. Niggas scared to go down there because they think they going to get kept. <laughs> right. Straight up. That's 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 Niggas a real mentality, though, shit. right? Yeah. They're like, bro, do I got a warrant? If I go down there to try to save your ass, they going to end up keeping me. Right. You know what I'm saying? Right. Like, fuck, right. nigga. Hey, right. you, fuck good it. luck, nigga. Let fuck me call uh, Jerry Jerry Barrel Bonds and get you out. You know what I'm saying? It's like, but that ain't how we need to operate. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? We need yeah. somebody who don't got no felonies to go down there and get our people out. Right. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I feel it, dog. Like, this is the type of stuff we need to start doing if we want to protect ourselves. Real talk. You know what I mean? If we just follow the law, like literally certain laws, like follow them the way they're supposed to be done, do the stuff that we're supposed to do to protect ourselves. We may not ourselves. think the law is so bad. Yeah, we might not think it's so. it sucks so much because... Right. 
it'll be working for us for in us our instead favor. of against us and, and against us. You know what right, I'm saying? Right, right. Like when the, when when brothers stood out there armed and they could you know they could legally carry weapons and they stood in the straight line with their weapons and it was legal. Nobody could say nothing. They legally had their weapons. What could you say, bro? Stop being scared, bro. Right. Why you got the gun under your jacket, bro? Why you over there hiding, being shifty, bro? It's legal, bro. Right. Stand outside with your Straight gun, up. bro, like everybody else. Real talk. You making us nervous how you acting right. with the weird shiftiness. Cut right. that shit. Take off the spoo right. right. Take the gun. I quit stashing it, bro. Right. Bro, be legit. Off top. You know what I'm saying? That's it. That's all you got to do, and we can survive more. And if we got more brothers and sisters doing Bef that, it'll look doper. It would. We'll be able to protect our you communities a lot better because people will be like, bro, these are smart individuals. You can't just go do and handle. Man, I'm saying too much. No, nah, you keep it. No, you preach. Me? You you Am talking the real. Much? I'm You're just not saying, saying like, too much, bro. You keeping it real because a lot of times we're ignorant to these things. And it's like if we would have only knew that we could have did this yeah. instead of acting a certain way. Yeah. We were just talking about this on Street Soldiers. Be who you are. Be who you it's is. Back to you with the car, bro. Mm -hmm. I so many stupid ass cars that I lost. You feel me? That I left or whatever. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Because exactly. I was just being dumb. You know the whole. Come on, bro. We got a song in our out here that's one of our favorite songs. And shots out to them. Shots out to the rapper who said it. But it's a mentality here in the Bay where artists say, "I ain't never. I ain't had L since Pac died." <laughs> shout right? my nigga Cash. Right. Shout right. out. Right. 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 That's On a God. mentality out here where Straight it's like up. niggas riding around with no L's. Right. And it's a, it's it's it's, it's, a, it's a thing. It's a, it's a thing. You know what I'm saying? It's like, bro. You could go get that fixed up. Get your license, my boy. <laughs> hey, the fell into a peers, bro. Just mom, go ahead and so like thirty dollars, hey, my boy. <laughs> just go pay the ticket, my boy. Like I'm gonna let Cass hear this. Come on, be nah, up. you for real though. Shouts out to Cass. <laughs> Shouts out to the team. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, because literally, that's that's something. When you talked about the growth, you know yeah. what I mean? The growth that I had is learning stuff like that. Whereas, like, how could I stay out of trouble? Right. You know what I mean? Like, how am I I don't have trouble? to do this. Yeah, how do I stay out of trouble? Oh, okay. Oh, so it's almost if like I got my license. Cause let me tell you the difference. When yeah. I didn't have my license and I got pulled over, they was all up in my whip, finding all the shit I had stashed. Yeah. They was doing every it was a bad night. Right? right? But when I had my license, insurance, and everything, I was cocky. What y'all pulling me out of Nah, for real, for real. You, I be hella cocky I'm with like, the bro, L's. bro, he like, bro, tail light. Bro, what is you talking about, nigga, bro? Cop, all right, bro, I bro, get it. All right, bro, bro. Write, write the, the ticket. ticket, nigga. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> write <laughs> the ticket, you know hey, what I'm saying? Hey, it's like, Do dang. me a favor. Don't forget to wash your back. What?